If you're ever planning on building a room addition and you need to dig underneath an existing concrete footing, this video could save you a lot of frustration. Now, the engineer called out for a 36 inch wide by 36 inch wide, 18 inch deep um, structural foundation pad for a post that's going to be sitting directly on top of the new foundation pad. In order to dig underneath the footing, we needed to cut a hole on the other side. The black arrow is pointing to a piece of plywood that's covering up a hole that was the dimension of the concrete footing that we needed. Without this hole, it would have been extremely difficult, if not impossible, to dig this footing pad out. So if you ever run into a situation like this, this is one way that you can handle it. Now the black arrow here is pointing to the dirt. If you look close enough, and I'm going to zoom in here, you can actually see where the dirt, the level of the new concrete foundation pad, it actually goes underneath the old concrete footing. Uh, and I believe it was about eight inches that we needed to dig underneath the footing. So there you go. If you're building a concrete foundation for a room addition and you need to do something like this, I hope this video helps.